Greetings and salutations and welcome to another event a quick tip. In today's video we're going to find the minimum distance between two parts, faces or whatever in Inventor Assembly. So let's get to it. So you see, if you go into normal assembly, I've just got my Ferris wheel up here and you go into tools, you've got measure. Now what will normally happen is, if you select it, you'll be trying to select, you'll just be measuring, just measuring the part distance and so if you try and collect the minimum distance between them, well it does that and it will just kind of do, just puts the minimum distance, the absolute minimum distance between the parts, which is fine. But sometimes you want to find the minimum distance between two parts, let's say, or parts in these two assemblies. Let's say I want to measure like this back face here to that back face at the end there. So which you can actually just go from, to which you can change it to actually when it comes up, part priority. So you can just select that part and you can then select this other part and you see it will then take the inside faces and just calculate the minimum distance but sometimes you want the absolute maximum distance and this is where you can use select face and edge and so you can just select the face here and the face on the back and whilst it will give you an angle it gives, also gives you the minimum distance of 276.974 millimeters and that's it it's that simple now if you want to know another quick tip if you press shift and then you right click, you can bring up all these features here, component priority, part priority, feature, body, select faces, sketch features, all of that jazz. So you don't even have to go into measure to specifically actually choose it. So whilst yes, it can be useful to have certain sub assemblies together, but if you want to measure certain distances, that is way, way quicker. Thank you for listening and I'll see you in the next video. Goodbye.